In this video, we'll go through how to convert speech to titles on the timeline and how to edit them. If you want to convert speech to subtitles with the subtitle editor and generate an SRT file, please see our other speech to text tutorial. Here's a crafting project on my timeline. At the start of the video, the narrator lists the items the viewer will need to follow along at home. Gather your materials. You will need a clean and dry Tetra Pak juice or milk carton, a cardboard toilet roll tube, duct tape. I want to put this list of items on screen as well. Just select the video or audio clip containing speech. Click speech to text. Specify the source language. Then add subtitles to timeline. The new titles are added to the project. Let's play it back. Gather your materials. You will need a clean and dry Tetra Pak juice or milk carton, a cardboard toilet roll tube, duct tape. You can easily edit your automatically converted speech to text to correct small transcription errors or format the title display options. If you don't need an individual title, as in this case where I already have a title at the start of the video, just select the title and either right click and delete or press the delete key. To edit the start or end of a title, just select the title, hover the mouse over the left or right edge until the mouse cursor changes, then click and drag to where you want the title to start or end. To correct transcription errors, assorted string and wool, double click the title, then double click the title in the preview window and edit the text. To split a title, position the scrubber where you want the split to occur. Select the title and then press the split icon or S on your keyboard. Then update the contents of both titles. You can use the alignment option to realign your title if the position has changed. You can change the way your titles look. Double click a title, then change it to how you want it. You can change the font and realign, and then maybe add a backdrop. To copy these changes to the rest of your titles, right click the title you just changed and click Copy Attributes. Then select the first title, then holding Shift, select the last title. Then right click and paste optional attributes. Deselect all, and for font changes, make sure filters is selected. And for backdrop changes, make sure animation is selected. Then press OK. All of your titles should now look the same. You could optionally edit titles in the subtitle editor, which can be more efficient if you have a lot of titles. Right click any title and choose Edit in Subtitle Editor, and all of your titles will load for editing. Please see our video on how to convert speech to text in the subtitle editor for more information. Let's play back what we've created. Gather your materials. You will need a clean and dry Tetra Pak juice or milk carton, a cardboard toilet roll tube, duct tape, assorted string and wool, coloured electrical tape, a ruler and pencil.